This is who I am. I'm ratchet. What up, you already know what it is. It's ratchet, ratchet, low bang bang, ratchet to be a Zach, and I'm over at the pop up talk running with Jab. You already know. Cool and what up? Where did you get the name Ratchet Low from? Shreveport, Ratchet City, being low key. See, being low key, I just I got a cousin named Low Key. I took the key off and made it low ratchet low. Um, see, as you can see, I talk low as a motherfucker. So low ratchet low. So Keep what, the two. <laughs> <laughs> so well, describe a situation where it inspired you, like with your music. Um, when I say when Gates seemed like. When Gates seen me, um, Gates like Gates came up to me like, man, little brother, you gonna do me like that? You don't, you gonna act like I don't know who you here? I'm look, I'm stuck. I'm like, man, this Gates saying this here, you know what I'm saying? And he like, hold up, you know what I'm saying? He that nigga like, man, I'm already knowing you, Ratchet. I already got your shit downloaded on my phone. I'm fucking with you, you know what I'm saying? And that type of shit. That then I wake up on my birthday one morning here in New York at a whole interview. He said, like, keep it up too, like my little dog, Ratchet Logan. Yeah, I was generalizing, you heard? I was giving an illustration. But, you know, that's 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 what I like. To, I like to keep it up too, you know, like my dog, you heard? Ratchet Logan. Ratchet Logan, you know what I'm saying? So that type of shit, though. That type of shit, that keep me going, keep me motivated, you know what I'm saying? Okay, that's what's up. So when did you start rapping? About nine years old or something, bro. Started rapping at a young age. So you always knew you wanted to rap? Yeah, I always, I always knew I wanted to be a rapper. So when did you achieve the recognition that you have in the music industry? Like, what made people take Ratchet Low serious? Oh, I think 2014, but I ain't never take it serious in 2014. I had came home from jail then, and I did the song Keep It Up too. And the song had went viral, but I never took the song serious. But I never took the rap series because I was still in the street, but that when they got to looking at me like, damn, he gonna do something, you know what I'm saying? So when they got everybody kept saying me like, man, drop something else, drop something else, drop something else. So I kept dropping and I kept dropping. It was like this little nigga here, you know what I'm saying? The mouth of the youth right now, you know what I'm saying? Like this little nigga here doing this shit, like, you gotta keep, you know what I'm saying? That what it was. Okay, what's the biggest challenge that you've had to overcome so far? Going through the judicial system, you know what I'm saying? Getting my freedom back, you know what I'm saying? Like like I said the first day, all my best advice to the little ones, don't get caught up in the system. Don't call that nigga your nigga because he ain't built for the system. You know what I'm saying? They're going to throw you under the bus, they get caught down bad with you anything, you know what I'm saying? Even if you don't get caught and he get caught, he's going to throw you under the bus, you know what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? Like, don't go to jail, bro, and don't don't be don't think that nigga your partner because he say he love you because he don't love you. That shit ain't real. That's fake. You know what I'm saying? He don't really love you. He just say that shit for the moment. You know what I'm saying? As soon as you get caught up or in the jam or anything, nigga gonna turn. You know what I'm saying? You know how that go. So that that's my biggest challenge though. Going through the system. Okay. What song do you have gets that the most frequent play? Like what what's get played the most? Bathroom, it be on 103 a lot, be on the radio a lot. And what you scared for that, they get a lot of play. You know what I'm saying? But I feel like bathroom for the radio bathroom. So. Okay, well, is there anyone who's helped you along the way? Yeah, Breeze, shit, my DJ. My brother, shit, Breeze. I, mean, I don't even look at him like no DJ, they're my brother. And shit, my brother, Poop Wild, you know what I'm saying, my team. We've been, you know what I'm saying, my team. Okay, so one line from your music that best describes you. Um, in my first day out song, I just dropped, what type of nigga bring your name in a jam? That's a burglary, not murder. This is who I am. I'm ratchet. You know what I'm saying? I'm ratchet. You know what I'm saying? I don't respect a nigga who bring a nigga name up and down. You know what I'm saying? So, that's how I'm coming. So, do you have any new music coming out, and where can we find your new music at? You can find the music at, yeah, well, I got, um, First Day Out out right now, the video out on YouTube right now. TikTok just dropped on YouTube right now. My new my new EP called Arraignment, that just dropped January 1st. 
Got a lot of raw shit on us, so y'all go fuck with that. They gonna be everywhere. You know what I'm saying? So, you know. You can find the music everywhere. Spotify, my mixtape, live mixtape, wherever you wanna go. Just type in right to low, you know what I'm saying? They gonna be there. And what's the name of your new tape coming up? Arraignment. I remember mean, my, 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 when I had first went to jail, I was trying to think of some music. I couldn't think of no music. Like, none of my old music. I ain't know none of it. So you have a lot of music saved up? like. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got I got Ooh, man. Did you already have music before you went in? Yeah, 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 yeah. I had music before I went in. I know I wrote. I ain't going to say a thousand. I get 900 songs. So you still going to drop that music along with the new music? Yeah, but I ain't got to it yet. I've been, I ain't wrote nothing since I've been at home. I ain't rapped nothing I wrote since I've been at home. My plan, though, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't 2018. I don't think I'm gonna use none of that. I don't think I'm gonna, I don't think I'm gonna rap nothing I wrote. I ain't writing no more. It's over with. I don't want it no more. I might put it on camera throwing away so y'all don't think I'm lying. <laughs> <laughs> so 2018, no more paper. Nah, it's over with. I mean, if I can't get in this bitch, I mean, I'm rapping what I live, so why not? I mean, I'm coming off of this hill. Whatever I feel at the moment, like I just put a post on Instagram, I rap what I feel. Fuck how you feel, you know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't, if I get in this bitch and I feel, you know what I'm saying? That's what I'm finna write about. That's what I'm finna rap about. I ain't doing no more writing. It's over with. It's dead. What's your Instagram name? My Instagram name, Ratchelo. It Ratchelo, R A T C A T T L O. No more writing for me. So, you know how they go. Yeah, you know, January 1st, arraignment, the EP dropping. They're going to be everywhere. My mixtape, Spotify Live mixtape. Everywhere. January 1st, you know. Some raw shit coming to y'all. You know, coming back. I'm back now. I told y'all to wait. You know what I'm saying? And now I'm here. The wait is over. RP Life, Mr. Sickers of the City. You know how that gotta go, man. Ratchet. Red niggas and shooters. That's my G chat. They don't want give a nigga pussy. They just asking me for money, baby. They don't want give a nigga pussy. They just asking me for money, baby. I told a bitch get on your shit and ho get out my face, shay. I told a bitch get on your shit and ho get out my face, sir. What you with yourself? They hit my line on a daily basis, asking for a blessing, baby. Yeah, get back, can't help you with that. Don't bend over in a prone position, touch the ground for your safety. Uh -huh. I'm laughing with that. If double XL, gold pack, not a Trojan, baby. 